happy holidays everyone out here in the garage ready to do the the grand tour of the village we did a nighttime video but ready to do the daytime video today so let's get this thing started well here we go this is the the finished village for this year pretty late posting christmas is in a couple days i was waiting on a few things to show up I'll do some close-ups here talk about a few of the details but about a hundred thousand pieces that's kind of an estimate based on weight over 900 minifigures over 1500 lights i have a video on my page right now of a nighttime uh, tour of our village if you want to check that out go ahead and subscribe by there if you want to see more videos this year next year and future years obviously every year we're looking to expand but right, we'll do a little circle here our winter village is in the garage those of you who are followed our videos in the past we have completely outgrown our house so we set this up in the garage have some open houses for neighbors had great turnout so far this year here this big mountain of ours one of the cool features of it is the inside or underneath the hidden north pole we'll do some more close-ups of that in a little bit just kind of want to do a little circle tour here So we're about five years of off and on work, kind of add sections a little bit each year, collected just the Winter Village sets when my kids were younger. Once we got up about six or seven years, we're like, this, this uh, white sheet on the kitchen table isn't cutting it anymore. And the Clark Griswold then we wanted to expand and make it bigger. So here we are about 15 feet long by about six feet deep, the final dimensions. So we'll just do some close-ups here. We'll start on the pier. The great fishing boat here from the Bricklink Designer Series. And the old fishing house. It kinda, kinda motivated me to do this whole pier and kinda coastal scene. Just figured it would look great as a winter village set. Some series 23 minifigures in there. The motor in my Ferris wheel <laughs> burned out. So that's why it's not moving. <clears throat> Little Christmas pirate ship here. Actually, let's zoom back around and show this awesome. Santa Pirate from BBG Forge. Right there. Hanging up. That's a great addition to our Winter Village Pirate scene. It's really just a tall ship's parade there. But that was a fun one to add in. lighthouse here it was a must add as soon as it came out in September built a little little peninsula there with some aspens that have been snowed on with their fall colors more on the pier a kind of modified Parisian restaurant there the old Friends Theater set converted it into. Well, they're showing the Muppets Christmas Carol right now, and all the Muppets are there to 
see the the screening. It's sold out tonight. Big crowd expected. Christmas parade going through town. Nutcracker marching band there. Get some more close ups on that in a bit. This, uh, a new Harry Potter, or not new, it was out this summer, this Grimmauld. One on the right there, and it needed more apartments down home, so I just duplicated it two more times, changed up the colors. Circle back around and got some of this from the front. again, or excuse me, the parade. <coughs> the Nutcracker marching band. I actually have a video on my page that kind of shows how I made some of those tubas and trombones techniques I used. The Santa balloon. Here's the new, new 2022 Winter Village set. It actually worked great for my space. I know a lot of people didn't like how it was a little too shallow, but out great for me. Jack and Sally, expert ice carvers. Most people don't know there, but they're really, really good. Create some great stuff. My son added this. Bad Batch, have them on a little campfire. Roasted marshmallows. Here we just kind of have a frozen pond in our village. Ice skating brings out all the celebrities. Hulk, Black Widow, Han, Leia. Scarlet Witch is waiting for Vision to show up. Some great curling matches going on. Sledding Hill here, yes, that is Clark Griswold sledding down. We have 15 movie scenes in our village, winter Christmas movie scenes. That was one of them there. And another one right there in front of us, Home Alone. Back on, circle back here. Good show. Dan Aykroyd, enjoying the Christmas raw salmon from the Christmas party. He was crashing. Had a bit of an accident here, not sure what happened. So, grandma. That ran over by a reindeer. Here's our kind of center plaza where all the action's happening today. Here's the new tram. I actually have it on this track that kind of circles back and forth. It doesn't work quite as well as I want with the color sensor. But sometimes it just doesn't stop. But get it moving sometimes, not right now. No Lego store in there. Maybe. Another Christmas scene, not sure. There's Buddy the Elf. Looking for his dad with the snow globe. I have to pull it real close there. We've got a Series 24 minifigure, the Newsy, selling newspapers. Thank you, Target, for getting those out early. on the snowblower, someone's not paying attention. The day of the Dead scene there, no. The time. Not that time of year per se, but just love the colors and how it looks. Christmas market. Some 
but you kind of see the wires there between all the poles and all the stuff. We have this fully lit, every building's lit up. Have a video on our page, kind of shows how that looked. All this kind of custom lighting from fairy lights. Took forever, but it was a lot of fun. And it's all done. Little kid band there. Singing Christmas songs for their family to enjoy. There, push the button. I'm outside, my hands are a little cold. It's a cold day here. Here's the people queuing up for going for the carriage rides. Here's George shopping for Christmas trees. Monkey Christmas is a must see in our family every holiday season. And my jumpy the squirrel down in there. The other Christmas holiday train. This is the one that came out like five years ago, and it is motored to move, but it doesn't really stay in sync with the, the older train there. Soka sadly had a barrier with clones. Church here. A love actually seen there. Another scene here on Christmas vacation. Cousin Eddie. Quite drizzle outside. We all know what Cousin Eddie's empty in there. Throwing a beer out in the nice weather, emptying this motorhome. The cider mill set by Mero Dudas. Grab that on Rebrickable. It's a must addition to anyone's winter village, I think. It's just beautifully, beautifully designed and built. These two here are also Rebrickable, that church and those little houses. Come back here a little bit. An old friend's winter cottage set, kind of modified a bit. Buildings here, filling space. Modify the Diagon Alley building, building to a ski and snowboard shop. Here, just filling space. And here we got poor Flick. Poor Flick. A triple dog dared and got stuck to the flagpole, but fortunately the firemen are there to help him out. Our ski resort, the base of it. A lot of activity there. Got some people playing some chess while they're enjoying some beverages, some food in between runs. The gingerbread house there is not gingerbread house. The elf clubhouse there actually converted into just kind of a ski lodge. That was a ski patrol lodge. In fact, I do I did order the that new ski lodge on the Bricklink Designer Program. I don't expect it sometime in 2023, but I think it'll go right there and I'll definitely have to redesign the whole layout. But excited about that. Some hiking trails up the mountain there. Treacherous path though, you gotta get by that snow garden. Do not have a chairlift yet, but I've put the towers in there to kind of, it's on the radar. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but 
I guess we'll get it started some someday. Let's come down here and check out the hidden North Pole. We got kind of the mail room there. Elves sorting through all the mail. Elves making the toys there. Down below we have the reindeer stables. Elves taking care of them. There's Rudolph's stable with the red door. Curtis. Courtesy of my son, Ben, had a nice little detail. We have the runway for Santa. And way back in there is the air traffic control center. The elves can make sure they get Santa on the right path. Elves break room here. In between making toys and helping out the reindeer, they love to play games. Air hockey, pool, Super Smash Brothers. Oh, someone fell over there. Some pinball. And up here we have Mrs. and Miss Claus. Or Miss, what did I say? Santa Claus and Mrs. Claus house. You can definitely hella ski off our ski resort. Very popular. Just have to share, share the mountain with the Grinch. He's heading back to Whoville to return the presents. Scene there, better off dead. Sean Cusack, forget his character's name, but kid wants his two dollars back. Take a tour of the back here. Got some LARPers dressed up, recreating the Empire Strikes Back scene. Train station. see kind of the little battery boxes of my fairy lights periodically. Oh, there's the ref, Dennis Leary, trying to hide from the cops, taking some people hostage in their own house. the grand tour. I believe we've covered everything. I'm just going to do a few more flyovers from a few different angles. Hopefully I captured a lot of the detail. That's what this winter village is all about. Trying to incorporate as much detail as we can.
you're still watching, be sure to subscribe. I have some great ideas for next year, which we may just get started on here in a week and have a little room to expand and I think we might try and do a zoo. My daughter loves animals, wants to be a vet. So I'd love to be able to create a zoo. Exactly where, that's to be determined. There you have it, our 2022 Lego Winter Village full video tour. Thanks for watching. Check out our other videos. Hope everyone has a great holiday season. Keep making those awesome Lego Winter Villages out there. Keep inspiring each other. Thanks again.